as we prepare for the memorial service at the 2012 annual conference. Recognizing and memorializing the honored dead of the annual conference, I would like for us to imagine the land in which they walked and the fields in which they labored. They were, as the great old hymn, Guide Me, O Thou Great Jehovah, suggests, pilgrims through this barren land. That's what we all are, pilgrims. And the land through which our pilgrimage takes us is sometimes fertile, but often feels barren. Leslie Newbigin, long ago a bishop in the United Church of India, wrote in his book, The Household of God, that the church is the pilgrim people of God. It's a great image, for it suggests that we are on our way to somewhere. We are not static. We are on the move to a destination, and that destination is the kingdom of God. It is not just out there in some unknown future, but is here, it is now, it is within. In the meantime, we may understand that on this pilgrimage, we are not alone. We are certainly dependent upon God, and we are dependent upon one another. This message will come at the end of a day when we have been speaking of the river that flows in us. We have been speaking of the interior life. We call it the life of faith. In our pilgrimage, we walk by faith. It is a journey that goes ever deeper. And so I hope that in this service of worship, we will dig some deeper wells. They are not new wells. The women and men whose lives we will celebrate have dug them before us and tasted of the waters that have flowed from them. By faith, they dug the wells. They dug them in times of spiritual drought, to find the water that lies deep. In the freshness of spring, when the snow has melted and the rains have been plentiful, the wells they dug have overflowed with abundance. And our colleagues in ministry, our friends, our beloved, they have taken water from those wells in all their seasons. And in our turn, we have enjoyed that water too. I take heart that in the book of Genesis, Isaac, the story reads, digged again the waters of wells, which they digged in the days of Abraham his father. For the Philistines had stopped them up after the death of Abraham, and he called their names after the names by which his father had called them. We are digging wells that our fathers and mothers in the faith knew, and they digged the wells which were dug before them by their fathers and mothers. And all have been sustained by drinking of the same deep waters, the waters of faith. Let us be about the business of digging deep wells. Let the waters of faith go deep, very deep, so we may all drink of the refreshment that God would give us by faith. <laughs> 